On the west coast of Australia, it's a city where you're never too far away from the water. And while it's a spectacular view up here, down below, it's a visual feast. Let's tuck in. Guys. Hey, now, you know, today's all about food, right? Woo but you won't be eating anything. Aww. But you will be feeding some awesome sea creatures. Yes. Yes. But those sea creatures might have big pointy teeth. Whoa. But I'm sure you guys will be fine. Come on, let's go. Well, that was an emotional roller coaster. Come on, let's go. The Western Australian coastline is massive, stretching out over 13,000 kilometres. That means there's a lot of things swimming around out there. This aquarium gives you a chance to get to know our marine mates a little better. Look at that bright green coral. So do you guys get out on the water much here? Definitely. Yeah, all, the all the time. All the time. I love going swimming. What's your favourite thing about WA? Well, the beaches is definitely up there. The ocean. The ocean. What's your favourite sea creature? Well, I like the biggest sea creatures there, so the blue whale. The blue whale. What about you, Zoe? I like seahorses. Oh. They're really cute. And what do you want to be when you grow up, Yanni? A marine scientist. That's what I've always wanted to be. You could work here in the aquarium. Yeah, that would be so awesome. Cool. All right, guys, these fish are looking pretty hungry. Should we find out what's for lunch? Yes. yes. Let's go. Okay. Hey guys! Hey! hey. So welcome here to Behind the Scenes at the Aquarium. We've got about 4,000 fish or different marine creatures like sharks and stingrays and every day we need to prepare about 35 kilos, even more of food for them. And this is where all that happens. What do seahorses eat? Yeah, all animals eat different things. Seahorses actually eat tiny food that we need to prepare somewhere else. It's like um, tiny little prawns basically and they'll slurp it through their big long mouth. Do you have any fish here that are like specific to WA? Western Australia has an amazing range of marine life and a lot of it can only be found here in Western Australia and we showcase that here at the aquarium. Now, I think our sharks are getting hungry. Can you help us out and carry these buckets out to our diver? See you guys! See you! Here you go, Nathan. Thanks guys, I'll see you on the other side. Look, big shark! Big shark! There are seven different species of sharks here in the aquarium, with the biggest being a three-metre grey nurse. These sharks only eat small food like fish and other small sharks. They're actually members of the same family as rays, the elasmobranchs. Both sharks and ray skeletons are made of cartilage, just like your ears or the tip of your nose. Oh, it just literally opened up them! OK, guys. It's time for you to get your hands dirty. It is feeding time. Woo! Let's go. Hey guys, welcome to Adventure Bay. So we're going to be hopping in the water pretty soon to feed some baby stingrays. Ready to go for a swim? Yes! Oh, guys, feel the bubbles in your boots. Is the water cold, guys? It's very exciting, but it's also very cold. Yeah, it feels all right. So can you guys see the stingrays under the water? So they're very shy still, they're little babies. So some, some of our biggest stingrays, they'll come over and take food from your hand, but these guys are still learning, so. These little uh, stingrays are still born with their barbs, so they can still be a little bit dangerous, but it's only defensive. So they only use it when they feel really threatened, but as long as you leave them alone and give them their space, they're perfectly safe. All right, so we've got a whole school of uh, fish in here. They're called scaly mackerel. They're really closely related to sardines, so you can see them all schooling in there. So we feed these guys a whole bunch of pellets, so you want to toss them out onto the water to feed the fish. Yeah, so if you put your hand in the water with the pellets around it, the fish will come and jump all over you. Shut. Whoa, this was a real emotional roller coaster. Yeah. It's chilly. <laughs> so, I've been told that they're totally harmless, but that doesn't stop me from being a little bit nervous. Wish me luck. 
It's a pretty surreal experience getting in the water with creatures that have been on this earth for over 420 million years. She's pretty brave swimming with those things. Seeing sharks look at you and swim straight at you is a feeling I don't think I'll ever forget. She is doing pretty good. Oh, look at that one. The longer I'm staying in here, the more comfortable I'm getting. And to be honest, I don't want to get out now. This is amazing. Mind blown. That was so cool. What a day. That was amazing. But I don't know about you guys. After watching those guys eat all day, I am starving. Should we go get some food? Woohoo!